Omar Figueroa is sponsored by St. Anthony's Home Health, located in McAllen, serving the entire Rio Grande Valley. Also, UFC, Ultimate Fitness Center in Westlaco, and AC Cuer Jr., your new Precinct 1 County Commissioner. VarsitySportsTV.com in Las Vegas with Omar Figueroa and also with Eric Gomez who's with Golden Boy Promotions and Mr. Gomez is here to talk to us a little bit about Omar Figueroa and uh, he is the Vice President of Golden Boy Promotions. First of all, Mr. Gomez, tell me a little bit about uh, Omar Figueroa. What are the qualities that Golden Boy likes about him? Well, you know, first of all, he can fight a little bit. <laughs> uh, he's got an excellent record. He's 8-0 now with eight knockouts. Um, he had some uh, pretty good amateur experience, but he, he's a very exciting fighter. He's got a big punch, very aggressive, and, uh, you know, you can't help but uh, notice the good looks. He's a good-looking kid, good-looking kid. Uh, you know, he, uh, he's he got a very, uh, very good discipline and uh, all-around package. All right, tell me a little bit about an up-and-coming fighter. He's 8-0, 8 KOs. What does it take for someone like that to, to make it to the big time, to, to be the showcase fighter for Golden Boy? Obviously, you gotta be able to fight a little bit. But you gotta be able to fight a little bit. He comes from a great area in Texas. He's got a lot of fans. Um, but you know, the most important thing is, 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 you know, the desire. And he's gotta have some ability. And uh, I think that he has, he has all of it. He has all of it. You know, the good looks, uh, the desire. He's got a lot of, a lot of ability, natural ability. And I think that it's just a matter of maturing into the sport and getting the experience. And that's where we come in and. We're trying to get him the right experience, and uh, hopefully one day he'll be able to challenge for a world title. All right, thank you very much. That is Eric Gomez, Golden Boy Promotions. I'm Carlos Roberto, VarsitySportsTV.com, with Omar Figueroa in Las Vegas. Earlier in the day, it was time for the press conference for the big fight. The main event being uh, Marcos Maidana, Argentina against Victor Cayo from the Dominican Republic. Boxers were there to talk about the fight and pose for pictures. Omar missed the press conference. He was taking care of boxer business. Today I missed the press conference because I had uh, an appointment with the ophthalmologist uh, due to the fact that uh, I guess my, my eye exam from that I got in June or July doesn't apply here. And uh, every state uh, has different rules against, I guess, the physical examination. So I was at the ophthalmologist, I was getting an MRA, checking my head, uh, seeing that everything's all right in there. Uh, but uh, yeah, I mean, I heard it wasn't that big of a deal, the press conference, but uh, still wanted to be there, you know, uh, big name guys, good, good guys with talent, and uh, just being around those guys, you know, it just influenced good on, on people, so I'm, I'm a little bummed that I missed it, but I had to get my physical examination done, check that my eyes were okay, and uh, everything seems fine, so I'm All good right. to go. They did introduce him to the press. Omar Figueroa, 8-0 no with AKOs. Uh, you can see we've got some power punchers on the other card. Omar later did spend some time taking in some of the sights of Las Vegas. There was some picture taken at Caesars Palace. A walk through the casino, no gambling. Remember, he's only 20 years old. How about a picture next to a statue of Joe Lewis? And then he found another famous boxer, Rocky Balboa, at Planet Hollywood. His mom snaps the photo walking around and enjoying some beautiful photography, and finally taking in one of the shows at Caesars Palace. That was about it for Omar. He turned in early this Thursday night. As far as Omar's opponent, it has changed. Akeem Orji backed out after taking a look at Omar's impressive 8-0 with 8 KO's record. Omar will fight Edgar Portillo, an up-and-coming boxer from Midland, Odessa. He is 6-3 with 2 KO's and 1 draw. Later today, we will have the weigh-in live on VarsitySportsTV.com. Coverage begins at 4.30. Be sure to click on Omar Live. And then tonight, an interview with Omar's opponent. Omar Figueroa is sponsored by St. Anthony's Home Health, located in McAllen, serving the entire Rio Grande Valley. Also, UFC, Ultimate Fitness Center in Westlaco, and AC Cuer Jr., your new Precinct 1 County Commissioner.